Okay, we got that one. Okay, now this one's right uh, down sun, state west. Uh, and I want to know if you can see an a angular rock uh, in the foreground. Roger, we have a Picking large up, uh, angular rock soil. in the foreground and looks like a, a much smaller rock a couple of inches to the left of it. Over. Right, and then on beyond it, about 10 feet, is an even larger rock that's very rounded. That uh, rock is about, uh, the closest one to you is about sticking out of the, the uh, sand about one foot. And it's about a foot and a half long, and it's about six inches uh, thick, but it's standing on edge. Roger. Roger, and we see the shadow of the limb. And the hill, the Roger, the, the little hill just beyond the shadow of the limb uh, is a, a pair of elongate craters uh, about, uh, probably the pair together is 40 feet long and 20 feet across, and they're probably six feet deep. We'll probably get some more uh, work in there later. We'd like it to come left about uh, five degrees over. Uh, back to the right about half as much. Okay. Okay, that looks good there, Neil. Okay. One hour, seven minutes time expended. Okay, you can make a mark, Houston. Roger, follow in. solar wind experiment now.
is Houston reading you loud and clear, over. Roger, the EVA is progressing beautifully. Uh, I believe they're setting up the flag now. Great. I guess you're about the only person around that doesn't have TV coverage of the scene. That's all right, I don't mind a bit. How is the quality of the TV? Oh, it's beautiful, Mike. It really is. Oh, geez, that's great. Is the lighting halfway decent? Yes, indeed. They've got the flag up now, and you can see the stars and stripes from the lunar surface. Beautiful, just If you can pull that end off a little bit. Tighten that end up a little bit. It won't go out. Yeah, okay. Neil, this is Houston, radio check over. Hi, Roger, Houston, loud and clear. Roger, out. loud and clear, Houston. Roger, buzz. evaluate the uh, various paces that a person can traveling on the surface. I believe I'm out of your field of view. Is that right now, Houston? That's uh, affirmative, Buzz. You're in our field of view now. You do have to be... All right, you do have to be... Uh, Rather careful uh, to keep track of where your center of mass is. Sometimes it takes about two or three paces to uh, make sure that uh, 
you've got your feet underneath you. And about two or three or maybe four easy paces can bring you to the fairly smooth uh, stop. Like a football player, you just have to put out to the side and cut a little bit. 